Okay, we'll start with the Mustard C49S, size 10, curved caddis hook. This is the uh, yellow quill buzzer. This is uh, Shear 40 knot black. And we'll just attach our tying thread at the front. And we want to go nice and even. Foundation, go back there. Tie down the end and then we go back over the thorax. Remember to flatten your thread as you go. This will keep it nice and even all the way. And then we want to go a little bit further. This is just a tip of the body then we can go back up again and over the thorax. Flatten our thread. forward and then we can go down the hook bend to back there and what we need is some uh, stripped peacock quill this is a uh, fluorescent yellow and just trim that off and to keep the body slender because it will build up a little when we have the UV resin on it we just go down touching turns little bit more about that and we can work our way back up just flatten the thread again go up over the body cover the quill end over the thorax again flatten it out just a little bit that I need to cover I'll just go back here like this there we are that's looking good. Then we can take it all the way back up again to there. <clears throat> Attach a hackle plier. I like to turn my hook this way when I'm doing this. We want open turns in between each wrap of quill so the black shines through and we work our way up to the thorax So, and we can turn that around, that's looking good. And then we can go around there, secure that, remove our hackle plier, and then just tie the end down. Again, flatten our thread. about that and we can remove that go over that there we 
we go. That's good. Take two goose or turkey biots. I want to just trim off the ends. Place them together. And we just tuck these in. Sure we've got those, yeah. Flatten our thread again. And just build up the thorax so it looks a little swollen. Let's check out that you've covered everything. There we go. I want to fold these over. To the right. Keep tension on your bobbin, we could tear them off like that. Good. Then we make a whip finish. The red quills imitate the swollen wing buds that are filled with haemoglobin. You do that, and take a little UV resin, you don't need much. I just want a fine coat to start with on the body. You want to go a little ways down into the hook of the quill. This will make it much stronger. I like to use a dubbing needle when I'm applying this because you get to be much more precise. That's looking good. So we just give that a blast with the UV light. us for now. And what we want, we want to do the top of the thorax, put on a blob and turn it upside down. That's good. And then we'll just give that Another blast with the UV light. And we want to drop underneath. Not much. Little on the sides on the wing buds. Cure it, and that is the finished yellow quill buzzer. If you enjoy the videos, please like, share, subscribe, and thanks for watching.